Priesthood gives me the opportunity to know people, get them when they're happy, as well as in moments that are sorrowful. To know that the Lord is using me to allow the people to experience His presence in the elements of bread and wine and in His Word. I love that I can bring more love, more healing into the world, which is so broken, and discover that I can't do it on my own. In fact, I can't do it at all. It's only the Lord who can do it. And He allows me to participate in healing the world. When I hear confessions, I can really be in touch with the personal problems. And so I feel I'm answering really the need of each person. It's a great joy to know that someone enters into a reconciliation room and is heavy burdened and then they leave knowing that Christ has forgiven them. And to be part of that experience, it's amazing. There's an image from the Gospel where Jesus talks about the householder who brings out of the storeroom things new and old. That's always been a part of the priest as elder, to know the tradition, to be able to make it present for life and the needs of people generation after generation. We rely on the help of the Lord God and our Savior, Jesus Christ. And we choose these men, our brothers, for priesthood in the presbyteral order. And through the sacrament, daily mass, confession, and the sacrament of the sick, more people will get to know God and knowing God more and more. Making the faith journey with others, to see them either opening up more to the Lord in a moment of crisis, feeling God's comfort, even a challenge sometimes to, to break away from self-destructive way of living to re receiving God's grace, God's love in their life. So you are really privileged to be that person people go to, often in the Good Fridays of their life, and you're allowed to accompany them on their way to the Easter. People seek out the priest, usually in the most joyful or sorrowful times of their lives. I see myself basically ministering as a priest to God's people in a way that allows uh, Christ to continue that ministry. The greatest blessing that I've ever had in my life is the love and friendship that comes to me through Jesus Christ. It will be my happiness to just continue in, in, that, in that life with Him, to be with Him. That love that I think we all need to discover, so it's my hope and my desire to, to share that with all the people that I serve in my ministry in the future. You lose your life so that someone else can encounter the same that I have been encountering. So it's not about me, but it's about God, about Christ, who encountered me, who came to meet me, gave me hope. And if I'm here, it's because of Him. We worship Your name.